And that's a wrap for my packing almost for my trip to San Antonio tomorrow. Really excited about that, it's a work trip, but outside of that, it's day number one in a way of daily vlogging. It's a new experiment I'm going to be doing on my channel here. Follow along. Everything that happens to me, sharing it here, the things that I learn, passing it along to you, the places that I see, and the, the struggles that I have, the successes that I have, all that. And I'm really making a big push to 2019, so follow along and let's see what we all can do together. Great, just got here in San Antonio and looking around the hotel room so far and the hotel so far. Top notch, let's check out the room. As I was thinking on the plane, I was listening to this podcast about the top three fears most people have, and this fear of, fear of success, failure, and just people judging you. And everything that I'm doing, this included, is what are people going to think if I vlog, if I vlog in public, and all this stuff. But the thing is, who cares? But uh, I'm not really too much into the monuments. I like to see it once and then from there, yeah. I've been vlogging on and off and I have over 500 videos on my channel. Isn't that crazy? That are published. I think it's over 600 when you include the unlisted one. But even with all that experience, there's still this fear that I have too of, you know, should I not fall as I walk down these steps. I have this fear of commitment that. I don't want to start something, have talk all big, and then four days later, I'm like, okay, that's that's just too hard. But the thing is, if we want to be super successful, all we have to do is pour that energy, get a plan in our head, and then just freaking do it. Obviously, like we all do, but I don't think I've really had a fear of success before. These are just random thoughts I have in my head here as I walk around San Antonio. Comparison, fear of what think, people think of me, yeah, I don't think it's as strong as some what some people will deal with, but fear of failure, definitely had that back and forth, but I think I've learned a lot over the last several years about myself. I'm always working on personal development myself, but just doing this daily vlogging, a commitment, stepping outside my comfort zone, it's a, uh, it's definitely going to be a big challenge, but when you have a big challenge and you face it and you go through it, that's when all the cool things start to happen. But on top of that is, it's not even just going through a failure, but having a plan, you think you know what the answers are or where you're gonna go with it but something totally different happens and that's happened to me a lot I used to have this podcast and I had this big plan but what really happened is I met all these cool people through the podcast community and things just really dramatically happened for me in a way I never really would have thought of One of the things I love about the YouTube community, YouTube Red back there, that's a really cool tunnel, is that I keep coming back to it. Every time I want to move over to Instagram or whatever it is, 
the YouTube community and the creators and the people that I'm meeting already again as I'm re-engaging myself back into this community is it's unbelievable. It, you have this common bond and sometimes you feel a little crazy as an entrepreneur or you're a creator or you're out doing unique things and a lot of people don't really understand that. It's a, it's a unique thing. It's new for most people. Oh, the sun's over there. But being around like minds is what the key element is to success. With that, it's time to get back to the hotel. I'm trying to find Starbucks and I've lost. about we tried to capture some ducks in the video we talked about pretty much everything else in between but I have to say San Antonio really has impressed me so far when I compare it to New Orleans as an example New Orleans has this theme of party and unique architecture that sort of thing but San Antonio has the, the river walk the uniqueness but it's a little bit more laid back and it's not so much focused on partying and the weather was perfect and I'm really excited about San Antonio. So tomorrow I'm here for this retreat I'm on. I'm going to be in meetings all day so the vlog's going to be a little bit... I'm not sure where we'll go with the vlog tomorrow but... And I'm not even really sure how this vlog is going to turn out but stick with me. We're going to, tra we're going to talk about this journey that I'm on and hopefully you can relate to some of the things that I'm going through and that we're going to share on this journey together. With that, San Antonio, I'm out.